Hey guys, it's Mysopods and more with me. Happy Flip It Friday. But you'll probably not see this until Saturday or sometime after because I'm going to have to edit it and getting a late start. But I hope everything's going well with you and I hope that you're taking care of yourselves and the ones you love. This Flip It Friday is going to be a little bit different. I'm not comfortable with the shot. I'll explain a little bit more of that as I move along. But what I'm going to be doing is stuttering through my words and stammering. But more importantly, I'm going to be going through my Porcelio Spinny Cornies bins, one of them. The reason is I found either a unique morph that couldn't really be identified or most likely what I think is Dwarf Whites because I'm not generally an optimist. I'm not a pessimist. I'm a realist. So I just don't, I don't know. My point is, what I'm going to be doing is going through this bin, looking it over, seeing how everything's going. I do poke around in these guys a little bit, and I know they're doing well because they're breeding. I'll try to show some of the little guys um, as I go through the bin, maybe before I put the tripod on, I'll bring the camera down and just kind of do a little flyby before they scurry away. And then I'll start pulling the wood out, showing it off to the camera, seeing what's in there, seeing what else I see. It could have been dwarf whites, it could have been a... I don't know. To me, they looked like large dwarf whites, but they also had a... Maybe I was seeing things, but a slightly different shape. I didn't I didn't save the pictures. I accidentally deleted them from my computer and can't recover them. Not the biggest deal, because hopefully we find them here. If not, then maybe they're not a problem, and there were only those two. But what happened was I took them out, took the pictures, put them back, and haven't seen them since. So... I think that's about it, and I think I've prattled on long enough, but one thing I want to do is say, if my daughters ever happen to watch these videos, GG, Dubs, and Bobo, I love you girls so much. So, with all that out of the way, and nothing more to say, let's do that little flyby and then uh, do a traditional Flip It Friday with a little spin on it. So, take care and go easy. So as you can see, this setup is not ideal, and I apologize for that. I did try a few ways to do this, and ended up kind of getting frustrated and stopping, and found myself resorting to one of my philosophies I have, is that when you find yourself idling, your wheels are spinning, or you're doing nothing because you're waiting for something to be perfect or ideal, sometimes the best thing to do is just do it genuinely and authentically and from the heart and it will come out exactly as that genuinely authentically and from the heart so this may not be the best and I apologize for that but what I'm going to be doing is opening this I'm gonna stop the film then and film gosh I sound old and do my little flyby that I forgot to do and then bring the camera back up but below I'm going to be putting the wood pulling it out and placing it here and letting them go I can get them all out of the bin later and as I pull the wood out if I I'll pull up to the camera to let you guys see it and point out if I see anything so I am going to do that in a moment I'm actually going to as I mentioned pull this off and do that flyby because I'm not always the smartest but again I'm authentic and genuine and this is from the heart so let's do that flyby
that flyby is done, let's hop in and I see that guy moving down there. Right here. What I'm going to do is pull that piece of wood up. I actually have two dishes off to the right, as I mentioned, in case I see anything I need to pull out. Kind of try to reach around the camera here. I'm going to put it down for a moment because I did mean to put some moss down here so that I didn't rest it on something hard. I want to point out kind of some of the different coloring that you'll see. Man, that looks really nice. Where are you at? I know there was one hanging out up on there. He may have ran. <laughs> that guy's in a strange foreign land. Let's put it back. Are you eating me right now, little guy? Leave you more or less where I picked you up.
this wood is actually crumbling underneath my fingers. I need to be mindful. Oh, that's a Trachelopis Arathki. <laughs> and this guy right here. Got my attention. Let's see if I can get him really quick, but not the end of the world. Oh, gone already, yep. Alrighty. I'll see if I can get him when we put him back. So many young. Goodness gracious. Don't eat my finger. I feel like you wanted to show off. And this area is specifically where I found those two, and that's why I'm trying to investigate it a little more thoroughly.
All right, so I'm gonna put this back together. I did not see any white dwarves, and that's good. But I'm gonna be checking this again very soon because I just don't, it worries me that I don't see what I saw, and so it's not there for me to verify. But I know I've seen at least two things that made me think of White Dwarf. So, maybe my eyes were deceiving me and I was wrong, but let's end this for a moment, and then I'm going to put this back together. <laughs>